Good evening. One student and a school bus driver are still in the hospital tonight after that pileup yesterday. About 125 students were on the four buses at the time of the crash. Police are learning more tonight about what caused it. News Channel 15's Megan Royce has the latest in tonight's top story. Mark and Heather, it was a chaotic scene on State Road 13 near North Webster. Police say leading up to the accident, it was a typical day for the kids and the bus drivers. They were taking the same route as usual back home from school. Four buses piled up. About 125 students, some injured on the side of the road. Something police in Kosciuszko County have never encountered before. Quite a few, most all of our officers are, are, you know, have families, and I think that was something that we were all thinking about as we were driving up there, not knowing what, what we were going to be uh, dealing with. Luckily, the injuries weren't as bad as they thought. They're very um, built to very uh, sturdy standards, and uh, the actual seats on the bus have uh, higher backs. But how could this happen? Four buses involved in the same accident. The collision that actually started from the very rear bus, Mr. Wagner's bus, uh, collided, then started sort of the actual chain reaction. Today, school here at Wawasee High School is carrying on as normal. The teachers let the students know they could access the school counselor, and we have an extra school nurse on hand today, and 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 just take care of any needs that those students had. In the meantime, police are taking a close look at all four school buses as part of the investigation. The Indiana State Police, the commercial vehicle section, actually is uh, doing the mechanical inspections on, the, on all buses to make sure that they uh, were uh, operating properly.